Call me old fashioned, but I would like my grandchildren to have something other than fake meat, impossible foods, synthetic food like substances. I'd like them to have real food. And if we have a dead ocean, we don't have oxygen. If there's no fish in the ocean to move the phytoplankton, 80% of our oxygen we don't have. I get really my knickers in a knot when I see the word sustainable. To me, it means that it's sustainable for that company. It doesn't mean that it's environmentally, ethically sustainable. If something is sustained, it's maintained at the same level. And I think we should leave the planet better than how we found it, which is not actually that difficult <laughs> because industrial agriculture is pillaging the, yeah. the soil, the planet, the ocean, and what have you. I was raised by a mom who believed that the mother of all was nature. And I'm a scientist. I do cancer research at Dalhousie University. I'm a bit nerdy about that. But the be all and end all for me as a supplement company or anyone that's making any kind of income on natural products or taking something from the earth has a moral obligation to give back and do more. Modern agriculture is almost universally destroying the thing from which it derives all its wealth. That thing is called soil. And modern agriculture with the tilling, plowing, with the use of herbicides and pesticides and every other side is murdering the soil, which is how you grow food. Whether you grow vegetables there, whether you grow wheat and corn, or whether you grow grass uh, and, and you're raising uh, ruminants, for example, on that. That is the golden goose and they are killing it, which is a stunningly bad idea. My farm is a permaculture farm. We don't till anything, we do cover crops, we don't plow the soil. It's healthy for the farm, it's healthy for the animals, it's healthy for, for my children and my grandchildren when they grow up. Children can play in the dirt and they can be with the animals. That's my vision of the future. Giving back, understanding the wisdom piece, respecting what nature wants us to learn and not thinking that we know more than it does, because we clearly don't. Uh, and that's not sustainable, that's regenerative. Regenerative is life and getting bigger and better and wiser. As Julianne was saying, let's get wiser, let's get more connected, let's uh, be better in the future than we are now.